Hi guys, we're finally back with another video. Today we're gonna be doing a little chit chat update. Yes, we didn't vlog or film anything for like a month. Yeah, I've been in Dubai for a month and finally I'm back, so she's, yeah. yeah. she's finally back so we can do a little chit chat, you know, life update, whatever. A lot has happened. A lot has happened, so grab a drink or tea and let's have a little talk. A little drink. Cheers. This tastes like watered down Sprite. Well, it is a Sprite, okay? With a little wine. <laughs> We put wine and Sprite Sorry, because it's a great combo, okay? You know, I need a little... I'm actually on a detox, I haven't had a drink for a while. Really? Yeah, because I've been drinking in Dubai a lot, so when I came back, I'm like, it's time for a detox. Like, I ate so much in Dubai. It's never so, yeah, you did. Fun. You know what I realized? Dubai has very good food. Mm. Like, when I first went to Dubai, like, very good. Actually. Eight years ago, I gained so much weight. Because really? Just... Yeah. Don't you remember that first time I went to Dubai? That very first time when I was like 19 years old. But that old. was a long time I don't think the food was as good then. Well, anyway. It was. Laura literally extended for so long. She was there for... How long you were there for? A whole I, month. I lost track. But I was there for a long time and I actually couldn't wait to get home. To my baby, Biggie. Yeah. I missed him so much. Actually, I was looking after her cat. He was here with my other two cats and it was a night. It was a zoo. I'm I think you. next time, you know what, next time this is not happening. So, don't try this at home, okay? Don't put three adult cats together when they Especially, home. especially when one of them is not neutered. Uh, don't blame it on my cats. They just... Let me just tell you that I didn't sleep for like three weeks. Because at night there would be like... Fights. Fights. I would literally run from the from, from my bed, probably three times a night. Yeah, at like the end one. She, she had to put them in separate rooms. At the end I had an eye twitch for a week. Because <laughs> I didn't sleep well. Like my eyes was twitching because I was like, oh my god, like I don't know. But you know what the problem is bad. the problem is unfortunately your cats, it's not my cat. That's the problem. Because your cat Pluto is not neutered and obviously he's very territorial and this so the, the thing is he didn't actually have a problem with him that much. I saw I mean, they, they would fight. For actually time. Venus had a more of a problem. This yeah, little... she was very scared of him. So if he like came close to her, she would be like hissing and like doing crazy Oh yeah, she would be like noises and like yeah. scratch and like all this stuff. So yeah, next time if I'm traveling, I'm gonna get a cat sitter, like aka <laughs> my brother, to stay in my house. <laughs> yeah. And yeah, definitely we can't put them together. But that was that. I was very bored. Very bored. Yeah, very bored. It took you two weeks to edit the vlog. <laughs> It took Claudia two weeks to edit the vlog. You probably have seen that we haven't posted anything. Yes, you probably were waiting for this vlog for a while. Sorry, the I, Dubai just, vlog. I just didn't really get myself to do it. Oh, really? <laughs> so yeah, I'm back to London now. Uh, the spring is here, although there is no sun. Yeah. There's no sign of sun today. We were so excited to film this video. Raining. Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah, look. You know what? We woke up this morning and it was sunny and we were like, okay, today we're gonna do this video. And then we got, I dyed my hair, I don't know if you can see. They're yeah, like black. black. They're not black, but they're just a bit actually dark vibes. vibes. So yeah, I dyed my hair this morning and we were excited to have a golden kind of lighting. And now it's like cloudy and rainy. Oh well, this is, this is it. This is London. London, welcome back to London. I think this video is going to be quite long because there's a lot to talk about. So maybe we should start with just like rumbling about weather <laughs> and about cats. <laughs> That's not even because important. Because <laughs> this sec well, the first thing we're going to talk about is probably the most exciting. Yeah, probably the most exciting thing for Laura. For me. Um, for you, I don't know if you've noticed. I feel like this video is about like this new year glow up. Although we're already in like May, not May, April. <laughs> oh, well, let's call this a... Glow up before our 30? Dirty 30? Oh yeah! Before that was my main. Yeah, the 30 main. Um, the little glow aim. up, you know, little life glow Not life glow up, <laughs> beauty glow <laughs> Yeah, get into my drink, why don't you? <laughs> What's happening with this lighting? So I'm just, uh, I don't know. So yeah, this was our glow up before we hit 30. And that's happening very soon. Yeah, very soon. So the first thing first. Drum first, roll, please. First things first <laughs> is I have finally decided while I was in Dubai to change my smile. Laura has new veneers, guys. All right. I don't know if you can see the difference, but I'm obsessed. 
She, that's why she was there for very long because I had to extend one more week because the teeth were ready yeah. and I had to go there like every day and it was such a long process but oh, I decided yeah. to finally do it. It was a time to change her teeth. It was time! Well, her teeth are now very natural. I don't think you can see. Well, let me come closer. Can you like see yourself? I need to maybe hide my face. There you go. <laughs> So, okay, so there is a story to this smile. Obviously. To this smile. <laughs> yeah. um, I found this dentist. Well, I went to this dentist more than a year ago. Yeah. A long time ago, you did, yeah. And it was kind of like my dream. It was probably on top of my list to do things to myself. Yeah. And finally... It was like number one thing to change. It was like number one thing to change. And yeah, it took me one year to finally decide to do it. You probably think, why did I change my teeth if my teeth were great before? Yeah. I mean, they were great at times. And they, were, they looked good on the videos, I guess. They looked good on the videos because this camera is supposed to make you look good and, you know, the lighting is good and everything. Yeah. But I had these teeth for seven years. She had them for seven years. They were, like, quite bulky, quite too big. Very bulky. For our, like, for your face features. You know, we have a very small face. Yeah, it was head. like, it was like, the teeth was like, out and the color was not good i didn't like the color at all it was like very like last time it looked not even white it looked white when i'm tanned and, you know yeah like sometimes it looked white obviously but it wasn't actually that white it so. wasn't even that white it was just very opaque yeah very opaque very bulky and just too big yeah they were really really too big and it was old already i had like stains on it like it was just the gums were not good, right? They were oh my gosh, the gums! Different sizes. I had this, I had this problem with this side of my smile that the gum was like weird. Yeah. Uh, so I would only smile from this side. I wouldn't even smile from front. Yeah. Um, but yeah. So this time I decided we are getting older and I need to look more natural. Yes, like you more know, real, like okay. more kind of I don't know, not useful. No, when you open your mouth, the first thing you see is like fake set of teeth. I mean, some people love that. I mean, don't get yeah, me wrong, actually, people to actually, be honest, lots of people, people go do. for that. Yeah. Laura wanted a natural smile, and I think I got it. And she got it, I know? got it. Uh, it was, oh my gosh, I'm so excited, I need like a breather. Wait, <laughs> Jesus, me too, even now I'm excited, because all I've been hearing about is the teeth, like 24-7. <laughs> so yeah, I basically had the very bulky, you know, fake smile for seven years, and I was beginning to get sick of it. Yeah. And I have so many pictures of how they looked and they were actually crooked, by the way. They weren't even straight. Maybe you can like include some pictures. Here. I'm gonna include some pictures here of Maybe how... before and after? So these are all the befores. I'm gonna put them in so you can see how crooked they were, how bulky they were, how crooked. fake they were and just you name it. You know, at that time when you did it seven years ago, they were great. Oh, I thought I had She loved smile. it. Like, you know. I loved it. I thought but... it was good, but I feel like now... Things change, technique changes, and like the material that people use for veneers are different, especially the dentist that I went with. Yeah. Uh, he specializes in like very translucent looking Translucent teeth. and they very... look very real. Like oh, yeah. you will not be able to say that this is veneers. They are like proper translucent. They have like this, I don't know, it's just. They're so thin. They're so thin. Like, you need to be careful. You're gonna break them. <laughs> oh my gosh, yeah. They're so thin. So, like, now, me, when me and Claudia smile, we actually look very much more similar because, because the, the teeth are, sm like, smaller, I smile. guess. Although my teeth are more, like, straight. Square. Because when I did my braces, like, seven years ago, they kind of, like... I don't know, straighten them like this, so they were all like kind of... They shaved them? Yeah, they shaved them. But very little, to make it very... Um, Show me square. All of them they did. I mean, like four, I think. I don't know. Oh, that's why they're so square. Yeah. They shaved them all like that. So it was like, you know, this perfect smile after I took off my braces. But whatever. Um, yeah, I think yeah that... my smile is more of a... Kind of like it's got this arch and it's like longer and a little yeah. bit it's like very thin it's just like it's like so beautiful i love it yes yeah, i'm so still i'm still very like not used to it like at times I'm, i say to claudia oh my gosh they're like almost too natural <laughs> yeah and i'm like oh, are they good like are they good enough i'm like yes just they're definitely much better than what they were before 
yeah, much better improvement. I'm extremely happy. And I feel happy. like you look younger now. Oh yeah, I feel right? like I've, I'm like five years younger. I swear. Yeah, because I feel like the 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 previous teeth because they were like so bulky, like almost like horse teeth. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm just telling the truth. Have something in my mouth. Sometimes you know, like sometimes they were just kind of like like. Oh yeah, like like stick out. You know what? Go go back to our videos, especially the one from what? No, I'm just I'm just like drama or whatever. Sorry. <laughs> go back to our videos, and um, if you watch it, you can like pay attention to my teeth, and they were like super bulky. They're like yes. Yeah. So, but you know what? I will tell you one thing. I liked them only in the evenings, yeah, in the evenings. with a flash photography. Yeah. It, like because it was like a very full big, smile, white, you know? fake kind of like it was all about that smile. It was all about that big, full smile. Yeah, so it only you know? really good looked good in the evening. But yeah, I'm gonna include some before and after and some pictures of these teeth now, how they look. Yeah. Cause they're very nice and very thin. I didn't even say who did my teeth. <laughs> we're like talking, talking, and I didn't. Even... Oh my gosh, we're talking about it for twenty minutes, and oh. we're like. Who did your teeth? Well, I think he's like a god when it comes to the teeth, and he's yeah. probably the best dentist in the world. Yeah, because Laura. If I say so. Because Laura is such a teeth freak, per perfectionist. Teeth obsessed type of person that she literally knows every single dentist in the world. And that's I mean, I wouldn't go that far. I know him and <laughs> that's the world. But like, when it comes to Instagram and finding, like, I don't know, dentists. So yeah, he's based in Dubai and his name is Dr. Duval. Yes, he's a very nice person. He literally specializes in like the most natural... The most natural... Beautiful... Yeah, beauty. like thin and just like, I don't know, like everything about those teeth. Yeah. Like, I'm gonna include his Instagram below so you can check it out, but look at his before and after. Yeah. Like, you are gonna die. It's really like speechless. And by the way, this is not even sponsored. This is not sponsored. Okay, I paid a lot. Laura money. was saving. I paid, I paid a lot for these teeth, and you probably won't see any luxury holes anytime soon. <laughs> oh, hell, definitely no. <laughs> that was your one yeah. luxury hole for the year. I'm wearing all my savings here, okay? <laughs> But yeah, mm. I'm very excited. It was like oh, the yeah, best decision. It's definitely worth it. So, because you're gonna have this teeth for you know ten years and oh, 15, fifteen years or more. Oh, really? Of course. I think ten years last fifteen years. Oh, okay. Well, so you know we're almost thirty, so it's time to look the part. Look the part. So yeah, I'm very excited. Let me know what you think. Yeah. Um. So when I was uh, in Dubai one year ago, this is when I actually met Dr. Duval because my friend was yeah. doing teeth with him and. I was like going with her to the dentist because I'm interested in these things. You know? <laughs> She's interested in dentists. I, I would go with her to see the process and then while we were there, we would see like probably a few of his clients and, yeah. and they would show us their teeth. And Laura, like, every single time she'd be like, Claudia, you have no idea that this is the best teeth I've ever seen in my whole entire life. I swear to God, like I've seen like maybe three different girls' teeth while I was there like the ones that Dr. Duval did yeah. and I was like speechless like in real life it yeah. looked like real teeth it was beautiful and white and thin and so this was my dream for a year yeah like all she kept talking about is the teeth the teeth and because she went to Dubai now and she knew she's gonna be there for three weeks I told her I it's either now or never it's your only opportunity because you're there for a while and yeah when you're doing teeth you need to be there for uh, you know at least two three yeah. weeks so I said it's you know, as soon as our 30th birthday, you either do it now or you don't. Yeah, and Claudio kept telling me, oh, your teeth are so bulky and fake, go do it. Um, it's not like, you know, I was bullying you, I'm just, I was just telling you the truth. Alright. And you had, like, you wanted to change it anyway, so... Yeah. I had to push you, to kind of like, just go for it. The upgrade is great, I love it. Okay, another little update is about me. So and I did a lip filler, finally. While I was in Dubai, she decided to go and do a lip filler. Can you believe it? Uh, well, I was... I didn't even tell you to do it. Yeah, I said, do it if you really want to, but... You you've been maybe, <laughs> maybe you've been overlining your lip a little too much. Yes, well, I've been overlining my lips for a while, and, you know, as you age, you lose volume in your lips. So I decided, you know what? Let's just do it. Like, I want a little, little bit of plump. Mm. A little bit of plump. But you can't even see it. You know what it looks like now? Like, Claudia used to overline her lips. Yeah, basically, it's very, very small. Like, 
I don't know if maybe you can show you. Very minimal. <laughs> I didn't really overline it now because I don't need to overline it no more. But it's very, very minimal. I think I did like one mil or maybe less. I think less. Maybe less. Less than one mil. I don't even know how much she put. But yeah, it was it was a good experience. I actually did it with the cannula. So that's like a different um, technique. Different technique, basically they put like you two holes here and with the cannula they go in like that and I don't know, it, it was it was it was good. It wasn't even painful because Yeah, because they give you the anesthetic like they, anesthetic. Yeah, they give you the anesthetic under your lips, which that was painful, I'm not even lying. Like yeah. that was I had tears in my eyes. It was very, very painful. Uh but then after that I didn't I didn't feel a thing. Um so yeah, I just I just decided, you know what? Um, might as well, you know, I just want a little bit of plum, a little bit of extra, a little bit of extra, I feel good now, you know, mm, I, did it, I did it last month, so yeah, it was good, swelling went down, swelling went down, it's very, very natural, so yeah, I'm actually considering fixing my lip, because I still have this little lump here that I don't like, and it's not gonna go away, you can maybe just like fill it in a little, no, this lump won't go away, I need to dissolve it. It's like a little kind of bubble. So I need to first dissolve it and then do it all over again. I just don't know what I'm gonna do. Mm. But for now they're fine. Yeah. I'm overlining them a little bit. But they got deflated a little bit because... It's been... Sorry, I'm like burping. <laughs> because it's been like one year and four months since I did my lip filler. Yeah, you did it a long, long time, time ago. ago. Yeah. But then you still have it. It's still there. I still have it at the bottom for sure. I just put a bit in the bottom, you know, to kind of make them even because actually my lips weren't even. Yeah, this that's side, why she even did it. Yeah, actually, I forgot to even say. Like, this side was much smaller than this side, so I always had to overline it here. Um, although I feel like I have some, like, weird shadow here. Can you see? Maybe it's gonna go away. I feel like lips are always tricky. Yeah. But anyway, maybe I can even include a before and after. Oh yeah, if you want to see. I'll include the before and after so you can see what I'm talking about, that they really did kind of shrunk. You know, it's funny because when we were 20, our lips were so full. We had huge lips. Okay. We had big lips. If you go down, down on our Instagram page, because that time there was no such thing as overlining or no yeah, We never overlined, we never changed lips in Photoshop, it was just our natural lips. So. Yeah, and the, yeah, there was no face shoot, there was no face up, there was nothing. So the lips was really, like, you know, full. Yeah. But, well, I'm very happy anyway. I'm happy I did it, I'm probably gonna redo it soon. So, yeah. they look nice and plump. But I'm not gonna go overboard, you know, because some people say once you start doing it, you wanna go bigger, bigger, bigger. But I don't think so. I don't like that look. I don't think it's super us. No, it doesn't because Too when I did it, I had my, they were a bit swollen for like a few days and when I was looking at myself in the mirror, I was like, oh my gosh, I don't like this look, it's so fake, I look so different, this is not me, like I, I was just not used to it, I was like, okay, no, yeah. I'm just, yeah, so, I think a, a little, little bit, a little bit is nice, yeah. yeah, so yeah, that was the little lip story, the lip story, um, yeah. I definitely feel much more, I don't know, confident? Yeah, no, yeah. I mean, we had big lips anyway. Yeah, but like, you know, sometimes when you don't wear makeup and you just want to put a little, you know, lip balm, it just, I don't know, it just feels a bit better, you know? <laughs> I mean, yeah. I feel like all I'm doing this vlog is touching my hair. Same. You know when I die, when you dye your hair, they're like so silky and nice, you just want to touch it. <laughs> Even mine are yeah. silky, but I need to dye mine soon. I actually can't believe how dark my hair is. Like, I'm still processing this, because I'm looking into the viewfinder and I'm like, mm, I look like you. <laughs> <laughs> We're twins, okay. Okay, go going back to the um, glow up. The glow up. Laura did something. The glow up continues. <laughs> okay, the glow up continues, and this time uh, it's about me. <laughs> We've taken turns today, okay. Okay, so just before I went to Dubai, I decided to do a nose filler. Laura did a nose filler. I don't even know if you can it, tell. It was a very spontaneous thing, and maybe you could have actually seen in the last video and also in the in the vlog before we went to Dubai. Yeah, yeah. We posted two two videos: the Dubai vlog and the one before. Yeah. And I actually already had a nose filler there, so yeah. I don't know if you've noticed, but if you look from the side, my nose is like 
Yeah, I didn't do it, and my nose is like it has that dip. The thing is, my nose was not cute. Okay, my nose was not cute. You know how it looked. It was like uh, fat. It was just. It was everything was wrong with it. I hated it. Like I actually hated my nose since I was maybe seventeen or eighteen. Yeah, it was quite a, a, a bulbulous. <laughs> it was a very bulbulous. <laughs> I'm not even like laughing because I have also fat nose. You don't have as fat as me, okay? Let's not go there. I'm just <laughs> coming close to show you that. <laughs> I, I want to show you that how it looks now. It looks very sleek from the side. The side didn't bother me, by the way. What bothered me was the front. So the front was very like yeah, round. Like here, that that little portion was like a little ball. A little ball. So it didn't have a bridge. So what the girl did, she put a little filler here. To kind of create a more of a bridge. And I don't know if you can see on this video. Like, let me go even closer. But now I feel like it's more It's definitely narrow. more slimmer. Like, yeah, it has illusion, a more, you know. It has a more of a narrow, slimmer illusion. And from the side, it looks very good. Like, I don't even, I don't change my nose on pictures anymore, by the way. I used to, like, always do something like this because it was like, eh. Yeah, mine from the side, as you can see, it's got that like you can't really see it, but it's very tiny bit for you. Let's you need to come closer. People can't see, Claudia. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> can you see? I don't know. A little bit. Can you see that? Maybe. Oh God. Maybe I need it too. What? I'm not telling you anything, but I definitely needed it. And when I came out of the when I did the filler, I was like, I was like, speechless. Yeah. Weren't you speechless? Pretty much. Like, we know. were both like this. Like, I never knew I needed a nose filler until now. And it's the best thing I ever did. Like, I love it. Yeah, it was literally this quick. <laughs> it was this quick. Very spontaneous it decision. Didn't, I didn't have any pain. It was just like here. And it's yeah. so, so much more narrow and like... I literally had a, I feel like I had a nose job. Like when I got back, I showed it to my boyfriend and he's like, wow, it looks so good. Like he even approved it. Like, even he, you know what's funny? And then I saw him the next day and he said, yeah, you need it too. What? Didn't you hear that? He said, yeah, you need a little bit here, you know, just to fill it up. And I'm like, I'm sorry, what? I'm gonna try and find some pictures to show oh. you the before and after because I feel like from here you can't tell, but um, you will see on the pictures before and after how it looks from front and from the side. Yeah. But I'm so happy. It was honestly really amazing filler. Yeah, it was. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm gonna continue doing it when like when it dissolves. Yeah, we, we literally went with our uh, friend because she was doing a lip filler. So we went with her and then our other friend and then uh, I went into her and I'm like, what do you think about my nose? And she's like, let's do it right now. And she did it for me and I was like, oh She literally did it there and then and, and I didn't even know she was doing it. Yeah, it was really funny. It was a little bit swollen like the next day because nose usually swells up a bit, but now it's fine and it looks really good. It's like, it looks... So much better. I don't know if you look back at our videos, you will probably ah. see. Like usually when we speak like this, you will see how my nose was going like out. It was like like a gargamel. Gargamel. <laughs> what are you talking uh. Polish for? <laughs> oh, I swear. By the way, I forgot to tell you actually. We were talking about my teeth and I forgot to tell them about my bottom teeth. Oh yeah, what happened with your bottom teeth? Oh yeah, she she did a little. So when I was in Dubai and I did my teeth. My bottom teeth were so stained, I haven't had them whitened for like three years and they yeah. were also very crooked, so you know what I did? I'll come close. I whitened my bottom teeth and she literally like straight And them. I sh shaved them like this, so they're sh kind of looking straight now. Yeah, the dentist kind of like went, went fully, sh like, I don't know. What do you think? Shaved them. Then. They obviously, one of the tooth goes still back, but I'm thinking maybe I'll do a little bonding. You either can do a bonding or if you don't want to wear Invisalign or whatever braces, they look better. You could do some lingual braces. No, I'm quite, I'm quite happy with them already. You know, they, they could, like? could go quite quick. Well, anyway, there's a lot to think about. <laughs> but my teeth are mm. the subject of this video. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. I don't know, I'm gonna come close and show you how they look. Oh yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I'm too excited. I'm, I need to share this excitement with somebody. Yeah. By the way, my hair's been growing. 
quite yeah. rapidly. I actually think I need to cut mine. They're a bit too long. I'm not that like fan of that much of long hair. Yeah. Cause they're just like I don't know, just so long. It's like. Do you remember when my hair was like till here? Now they're like so much longer. Look. Yeah. Yeah, they grew actually quite a lot. Quite happy with it. Anyway, the last but not least, I think we have a last update. Last update, it's a bit of a personal one which we won't get much into the details. It's a bit of a personal update which we're not gonna be talking about because I don't really like to talk about my personal life. But... <laughs> oh, oh dear. dear. Um, I'm actually single. Clara's single and she's moving out of this apartment very soon. Oh yeah, of this beautiful apartment. <laughs> which is actually gonna be Quite so sad. sad. But, um, you know, you have to, you have to life, happen. life, life happens. happens, life happens, yeah, and life happens, no drink, <laughs> <laughs> we won't get into much detail because these things are too private to talk to, yeah, I talk to, to we, talk about, no, we never really shared our private life, our relationship life, whatever on this channel, so we won't, we won't get into it, but, yeah, that's one of the reasons why we've been a little slower, why Cloud has been a little slow, and Claudia, well, well yeah, you've been slow, Videos. You know, it's been a few months of I'm kind of like, you know, healing, if I say so. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but yeah, now I'm good. Um, so yeah, new year, new us. New year, new us. Very excited for the summer. Let's yeah. see what the life has in store for me. Let's see. Yeah. But um, I'm excited. I'm excited too, actually. Uh, I really want to move out from London. <laughs> I don't know, at some point. Tell me about it. I really do as well. Um, like, I feel like... The life here is not the life for me and Claudia. No. I feel like we need to we, need, we need the sun. We need the sun to thrive and <laughs> we also need um, glam life and that means we need to move to LA. <laughs> <laughs> Let me put it that way. Actually, that's true. Like, I feel like this London life is not very... I mean, you know, because we've been here for five years, it's kind of boring already. We've done everything. Yeah. We've been out to the same places. Mm. Like, we get know. bored of places very easily. You know? And anyway, you know, you only live once, might as well live in a few different places. Yeah, we really want to try maybe this year or maybe next year. Probably next year because this, I don't think this year is not possible. I feel like COVID wasted so many years for Listen, us. Listen, COVID wasted two years of our lives and I'm gonna blame it on, on, on the COVID. So I feel like we should be telling people we're actually not 29, we're 27. <laughs> yesterday I got a compliment in the shop and this girl said that I look so young <laughs> <laughs> well I look younger now with my new set of grills yeah. thieves well anyway um I don't know what's gonna be our next video mm, maybe a spring haul maybe like a spring type haul yeah. um, maybe some vlog we're gonna try and film one video a week we're not promising two videos Le like. we're not promising anything yet because you know the the life is gonna, gonna have to be look, at the moment. Kyle's gonna have a lot of packing to do soon, and then yeah, yeah, it's yeah, it's gonna be quite hectic. But I think one video a week we can do. Yeah, we can, we can definitely, do we can video. try. And I still wanted to do the video about my Invisalign journey. Oh yeah, and that was not quite easy. So yeah, why not? Or do that. maybe we should do like a video like all about our teeth and like talk about everything. I'm gonna be a long ass video. I just need to find this one picture of my team before. Do you remember that picture? <laughs> that was a horror movie That's picture. That's a horror movie. Because no one, even, no one ever even knows. Are you even, do you even want to expose yourself like this? I won't expose the face, I just expose the teeth. <laughs>
one thing that we can talk about, but I think we should stop now because I'm sweating. Yes. I'm like, it's been a, it's been a long. Oh, I have an update. What? This is a very actually exciting update. What is it? Well, me and Clary have come to a very interesting agreement uh, last few days ago, and that is, and it's big life change. Oh, what? <laughs> life change. What? We, that we want to move out of London? No. So we we decided that it's time that oh oh big, yeah that's a big big, big change yeah that's another update that's another update so we decided that we want to stop taking our contraception pills because we've been taking our contraception for thirteen years thirteen or twelve years since well we were on contraception since we were eighteen years old and now we're almost thirty yeah so yeah twelve years. Yep, twelve. It's been twelve years and of I've, a roller coaster. Of a roller coaster, and I think it's finally time that we get off the pill. Yeah, because I think it's affecting our life. Yeah, I feel like it. I feel like I don't know. Like it definitely has some side ups, effects. Side effects. It has yeah. a lot of side effects, and I think I've watched a lot of videos recently about girls coming off the pill because I wanted to see. Mm. what it's like to come off the pill so there is a lot of videos out there that you can watch and see and like i've read all the comments from all the people telling their stories mm. and me and Clyde have decided that i think it's time it's time because we're old now and like you yeah. know we're, just... we're not that old okay, okay <laughs> don't get it twisted okay <laughs> we're not old i feel like we're damaging our bodies by taking these extra hormones and they're mm. just like we, we have so many side effects, like we have no energy. Definitely no energy. I'm just always Laura, ready. Laura, like I'm just a bitch, I've been a bitch for 10 years. <laughs> Laura's been the biggest bitch on the planet. <laughs> Actually, that's one of your worst side effects. Oh my god. If you will. It's the moodiness. And yeah. it's also, like, the periods are not regular. Oh yeah, that's the worst. And then it's always long. Like sometimes I don't have a period for three months, but then when I do have it, it's for three weeks. And I oh, have and I have periods like usually every one or two months, and it lasts two, three weeks. It's yeah. non-stop. It's like it's like yeah, it's messing better. with your hormone. It's like messing with your mind. Yeah. And there is also depression. Like a lot of people that take the pills, they have like depression yeah. and like like you feel sad. You you're very moody. Yeah. Sometimes, definitely for me. Yeah, and we have also anxiety. Oh yeah, that's actually the biggest thing for me. It's not like I'm depressed or sad. This I never really had that. Much. I mean, because we're kind of a happy people. We're happy people, but, but we could be even more happy. But the one thing that definitely I realize is the anxiety. We would get. We have so much anxiety, and I feel like it's getting worse and worse. And, worse. and we never had anxiety. And we never have anxiety in our life. Mm. Like never. Now I have anxiety. I have anxiety taking pictures. I have anxiety being in public. I have anxiety walking in the shop alone. Like, for example, <laughs> like when when I meet yeah. when when I used to live in like in up north and Claudia lived here and we used to meet in like I don't know Selfridges or Harrods and she, yeah we said this before in our videos like you literally <laughs> had so much anxiety being in the shop. Alone. I would have to go hide in the toilet. <laughs> Yeah. Not hide, but I would be like calling, non-stop non calling, Claudia, where are you, where are you, where are you? Because I didn't want to be alone, I was like having like shakiness, anxiety. Yeah, the anxiety and the worriness, like we worry a lot. Yeah. And that's actually a side effect of the pills, which we never actually knew. But because yeah. we watched some of these videos, when these girls said it, we were like, oh my god. This is, the, all the that's things true. these girls said was yeah. literally story of our life. So this year is all about healing yeah. our body and fixing and... You know, Being, you becoming the be the best version of ourselves, the so. mind, the looks. <laughs> but I'm quite Jesus. excited. I think uh, we are getting on the pill this week or next week. Ne next week. week, yeah. What do you mean next week? I think this week. Le come on, we need to do it, and we're gonna do it together. Let us know if you want us to like document how we feel. I'm scared. I hope we're not gonna get like some crazy mood swings because I don't really have mood swings. Come on, we're, we're even before... Actually, yeah, I do sometimes. Yeah, like, yeah. I cry a lot. I'm such a sensitive person. I'm like, I see something funny, I cry. I see something <laughs> loving, I cry. I see something good, I cry. Like, I, I, I look out the window, I... <laughs> I mean, maybe not that, but... Mm. 
mean, I, I look at the window, I cry, it's raining. <laughs> Jesus. But yeah, let us know if you want to see like a um, video about what happened to us after the we saw the pills. I don't know. But what apparently, happened to us, we got like a pregnant. Well, you maybe. No, hell me. no. <laughs> I'm not, you know, active these days. <laughs> but I will say, I'm still gonna get off my pill and I'm still not gonna get pregnant just yet because if you get pregnant, I'm not looking after that child. <laughs> because we're still too young, we're not ready for children, okay, so... Yes, I know. Um, well, I was saying something and you completely went into my conversation. Sorry. I was saying, okay, oh, so basically apparently it takes about six months to a year for your period to regulate. What? After you stop your pill. This long? Yeah. Jesus Christ. But, how but the thing is we don't have regular periods anyway, so... But how amazing it's gonna be to like... Have your period every month. You know when it's coming. Definitely. You know that you like don't want to book holiday in that time if you're going to Maldives. I don't know with your boyfriend. You know. True. I feel yeah. like our life is gonna change for the better. Yeah. Maybe give us some comments below if you went off the pill. By the way, we're taking the mini pill. We're not taking the pill. We're taking the mini pill, Sarah Z. If you're in England, you probably know what that is. It's a pill that you take every single day. Yes, like every single day, and then sometimes you get periods, sometimes not. We used to be on the other pill, which you take the double one. hormone, which really gave us the worst migraine. Claudia had a mini stroke. Oh what? <laughs> you did? <laughs> you had a mini stroke from the pill, and I keep having Actually, migraines with aura, I do which is that. called migraines with aura, so I can't see. Yeah, that's some, some mini strokes then, right in there. Yeah, I have like, literally, I have... But it's watched. really dangerous actually, those uh, two hormone pills. Yeah, I, this happened to me like a long time ago, when I was like maybe 22 or something. Yeah, so we stopped them immediately, we can't yeah. take them, the doctor said like, we can't take these pills. Yeah, like literally, I had this, I was working, I was working in the Blockbusters, okay? That was my work. Yeah. I was standing there on my tail, suddenly, I literally couldn't see anything, I feel like my... Like I forgot how to speak. You did. You couldn't speak. I couldn't. I couldn't speak. I had a You're customer, like, and I was like, uh, <laughs> no. I swear it was very scary. I literally went to a, I, a, a and E. I went to a, a and E because I was like, what the hell happened to me? And that was because of the pills. So I could like literally stopped them that same day, and I got the implant. But that's another story. Yeah, we also got implant, which was the one in the hand, which gave, which made me put so much weight, and it was impossible to lose. So that's another. Yeah, we didn't like the implant either. Actually, the implant wasn't too bad for me. But I yeah, don't it wasn't it. that bad. I don't me. want no hormones. I want to have regular periods. I want to be mm. a normal woman. Okay, I don't want no 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 this bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh dear. Hello. Oh my kitty came. Oh, look at this little girl. Actually, talking about the migraines with aura. I started having them obviously when I was on the other pill, but I still have them now till this day. Migraines with aura. Yeah. Like so, for example, what happens is I suddenly can't see. Like it's everything is blurry. Like light hurts you, so you have to be like somewhere dark. And then right like half an hour later, you get the worst migraine, and it lasts for hours. Yeah, I still have some migraines. Now I actually then. had it re recently. I had it like two months ago. One thing I have sometimes if I get up too fast, oh, I have this all the time. I feel a bit dizzy. Like, who a bit like, oh, am I gonna like fall on the floor in a minute? We have no energy. I think it's all the the pills talking here, you know, it's the pills. But I'm excited. Well, I'm excited for the future. You know. Same. Anyway, we hope you enjoyed this little update chit yeah. chat video. It's been a lot of talking. It's been a lot of talking. It's been a mouthful. <laughs> Hopefully, we'll be back with another video very soon. Um, yeah, probably next week we're gonna have a maybe like a spring haul. Or yeah, we'll try to film something. But yeah, I guess we'll see in the next video. Bye. Okay, so I wanted to include this clip quickly into the video of the teeth. Let's see. Maybe I should like move us slightly. And move away. Sorry. So here is the tip. Now you can see the gums. And you can see how like translucent they are. Let me zoom in. They're so translucent. They look like real teeth. I'm not gonna even lie. They look so real. And when I talk now, like when I talk, it's a bit more less bulky. Yeah, it's look like at the bottom ones. Oh. So good.
And this is my lips. Let's show your lips. Natural. And this is my nose. Very natural. Plum. Oh yeah, here you can see the nose. Oh, and you can see now, now maybe my nose, the difference. But your nose is... Can you see it has a sl sl soft dip, but like a soft little dip. I don't know. Let me know. If, should I do it or no? I don't know. I don't think you need that. I needed it. <laughs> the teeth. By the way, this color of this teeth is much more, I don't know, like a bluish white. Bluer undertone. The, 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 her old teeth was like yellow. Like warm. This warm is, tone. well, this has still a bit of yellow in it to look natural, but it's more of like a bleached. It's actually BL3, the color. BL3, yeah. So it's not that white, but obviously now I have tan, so... Yeah. Ah. <laughs> okay, bye. We're going now. Bye.